And while he's in Philadelphia, the Pope will be speaking to more than a million young Catholics from all over the country. A group of students and faculty from Beaverton's Jesuit High School will be there. Alicia Esch is live at Jesuit High School with more on their goals. Good afternoon, Alicia. And good afternoon to you, Ken and Jenny. I'm right here in the heart of Jesuit High School, and this school is just buzzing all the way down and back and forth with kids excited about the Pope, the visit. And I spoke with the six students and three faculty members that are on their way right now to see the Pope about their hopes and dreams for this journey ahead. Are you super stoked? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> These six students from Jesuit High School are about to take the journey of a lifetime. They and some one million other Jesuit students will come together to see and hear Pope Francis in Philadelphia. I'm just honestly looking forward to seeing him and like being like in the same place as he is because he's this kind and compassionate person. Oh, I'm told all these students were chosen because of their introspection and commitment to faith, and they'll participate in several events, including a service on Saturday hosted by the Pope and a Mass on Sunday with more than 1.5 million others. I think it's really big, especially because Portland is like way on the West Coast, and we get to go all the way over to the East Coast and be part of like such a big community all coming together. All the students will eat, sleep, and attend small groups together at St. Joseph's School in Philadelphia, but they each have unique questions and hopes, including getting clarity on issues we all face today, like divorce and gay marriage. Gay marriage is a huge thing. It's very controversial, and as a judge, as like a Catholic, we're not usually right. open to that, but I am, as Jesuits, we're open to social justice and social change, and we're very proud of Pope Francis for being able to stand up for what's right. Pope Francis is the first Jesuit Pope, and Jesuits are an order inside the Catholic Church focused on learning. And that's just what these students hope most for this trip, to learn. What he recommends us to do as good Catholics. Now, I'm going to be in contact with all of the kids in this group throughout their entire journey, checking in with them on Sunday. And in fact, I've been receiving texts from them already throughout the day as they're on their way there. Just found out, Ken and Jenny, they're delayed in Chicago for at least three hours. As you might imagine, there's quite a backup happening right now from all the different people who are trying to get to Philadelphia to see the Pope, of which this group is one. But of course, I'll keep everybody updated on their progress. All right. Thank you very much, Alicia. Very